Cascades is a company that produces, converts, and markets packaging and tissue products composed mainly of recycled fibers. Cascades employs more than 11,000 people in more than 100 operating units in North America and Europe. It was founded in 1964. Topic History The Lemaire family founded the Drummond Pulp and Fiber Company in 1957 which is involved in the recovery of household and industrial waste. In 1964, Antonio Lemaire and his sons officially ventured into the production of paper made from recycled fibers when they took over a disaffected mill in Kingsley Falls, Quebec, owned by the Dominion Paper Co., Papier Cascades Inc. was born of that transaction. In 1971, Cascades began its expansion in Kingsley Falls with the creation of Cascades Former Pack, its first molded pulp mill to use 100% recycled fibers. The event marked the beginning of a veritable paper-making corporation in a small town in the center of Quebec from 1972 to 1977. The successive start-up of Papier Kingsley Falls, multi-layer board, Cascades Industries, tissue paper, plastics Cascades and Cascades Conversion. In 1976, the Lemaire brothers brought their skill and knowledge outside Kingsley Falls for the first time with the start-up of the containerboard mill Papier Cascades in Cabano, Quebec. This was the beginning of a great adventure that would bring Cascades all over the world. In 1983 Cascades shares began trading on the Montreal Stock Exchange. That same year, its entry into the United States began with the start-up of Cascades Industries Inc. in Rockingham, North Carolina. In Quebec, Cascades began producing craft paper in East Angus and acquired a boxboard plant in Jonquier the following year. In 1985, the company made its entry into Europe with the acquisition of a boxboard plant in La Rochette, France. This new expansion took shape in 1986 with the creation of Cascades SA and the acquisition of another French boxboard mill in Blendex. From 1987 to 1989, other mills located in Sweden and Belgium became part of the Cascades group as well, Juppefors AB in Sweden and Kartenfabriek van Duffel NV in Belgium. The Belgian mill was renamed Cascades Duffel NV but ceased its production in 1993 after heavy losses and then was immediately transformed into a cutting centre for the other European mills of the group. Declared definitively closed in the accounts of 1997, it was reconverted in 2002 by the ex-president of the Board of Cascades, Laurent Lemaire, to a so-called internal commercial agency, under the name with slightly modified orthography of Cascade Duffel NV, and having only one unit of establishment called Corton Fabric Van Oeffel, located at the exact address of the old mill Kartenfabriek van Duffel which was resold by Cascades to another company in 1998. This so-called agency before different fiscal controls, without collaborator working in Belgium, was implied at the time of exports of cartonboard out of Europe, in particular those in transit by the port of Antwerp according to boards of directors of Cascades SA of June 28, 2002 and November 3, 2003. 
Since 2009, M. Stefan Theolia and M. Vincent Le Stringent despite he died in 2005 are not any more members of the board of Cascades Duffel NV. Both have been replaced in May 2009 by M. Jean Goulet, General Manager of Cascades SAS France, and by M. Zaki Hand, Investor Relations Manager at Reno de Medici. But if Cascades Duffel NV was liquidated with immediate effect on the 28th of December 2011, the story seems not finished yet. Topic expansion The 80s decade played out in a spirit of innovation with the creation of a research and development center in 1985 in Kingsley Falls. The facility became the largest private Canadian research and development center in the pulp and paper industry. On the eve of the 90s decade, Cascades became daring when it created Cascades Energy. This subsidiary controlled a brand new cogeneration plant powered by natural gas, the first in Canada, and whose mandate was to provide the energy required by all the Cascades mills in Kingsley Falls. The success of this project enabled Cascades to invest further in the prospective energy sector with the acquisition of Borelix in 1995. Today, Borelix's shares are traded on the Toronto Stock Exchange in which Cascades holds a 34% interest. Cascades Energy paved the way for a series of acquisitions in which Cascades activities were largely diversified. The purchase of Roland and Paperboard Industries Corporation in 1992, Perkins Papers in 1995, Provincial Papers in 1997 and, that same year, the creation of Narampak in partnership with Domtar, led to the restructuring of Cascades into five distinct corporate groups whose operations were focused as much in the sector of specialized packaging as in those of container board, tissue paper, fine papers and boxboard. On an international level, Cascades expansion continued in Europe with the acquisition of the Boxboard Mill in Arnsberg, Germany in 1997 and the start-up of a sheeting operation in Wensbury, England in 1998. Upon entering the new millennium, the scope of the tissue paper sector grew in 2001 with the acquisition of the mills in Pennsylvania and in Wisconsin. Two years later, the group sustained its momentum and set up shop in Alberta, in New York, in Arizona, in Oregon and in Tennessee. In 2004, the boxboard sector stood out with the acquisition of Doparco Inc., a leader in the packaging products sector destined for the quick service restaurant industry. Not to be left out, Narampak proceeded with the implementation, between 2001 and 2006, of several ultra-modern corrugated cardboard mills in Canada and in the United States. In 2004, Cascades created in Europe four new companies in Luxembourg Cascades Luxembourg Saal, Narampak Luxembourg Saal, Cascades Hungary Limited Luxembourg Branch and Narampak Limited Luxembourg Branch Beginning of 2010 Cascades Canada Inc. Luxembourg branch was created, and with the closure of Cascades Duffel NV in Belgium, the closure of Narampak Limited Luxembourg branch and the existing pulp and paper Cascades NV become BV, in the Netherlands, that carries to four the number of companies in service in 2012 into the Benelux without any co-worker 
who works on it. Narampak Luxembourg Saal was closed in September 2008 by incorporation into Cascades Luxembourg Saal, new capital February 2012, 64,933,600 United States dollars and beginning of February 2012, Cascades Canada Inc. Luxembourg branch changed her name to Cascades Canada ULC Luxembourg branch. In summer 2017, Cascades opened a brand new mill in Scappoose, Oregon. The Cascades Tissue Group Oregon converting plant will employ 80 full-time workers in the production of its paper products. Topic Challenges An appreciating Canadian dollar, an increase in energy prices and the cost of fiber, fierce competition. The 2000s also provided challenges for Cascades, which forced it to implement a significant rationalization plan. This process resulted in, the closure of mills in Thunder Bay, Montreal, Red Rock, Pickering, Buffalo and Boise Le Châtel. In 2005, the company proceeded with the sale of its fine papers Cascades Resources and its tissue paper wood distribution assets. With the purchase of Domtar's shares in Narampak in 2006 and the merger of its European boxboard operations with Reno de Medici in 2007, Cascade has consolidated its position as a leader in the containerboard and boxboard sectors. In 2008, North American boxboard activities were integrated into Narampak's cartonboard activities. In addition to creating synergy, this integration allowed better sharing of technology and led to the creation of a larger packaging group to meet the needs of clients in Canada and the United States. In 2011, Cascades named Mario Plourd Chief Operating Officer, enabling Alain Lemaire, President and Chief Executive Officer, to devote more time to the strategic vision of the company. Also in 2011, Cascades sold Doparco Inc., its paper cup and carton converting business for the quick service restaurant and food service industries, to Reynolds Group Holdings Limited. Net proceeds from the transaction will mainly be used to pay down Cascades' debt. Cascades is a member of the Forest Products Association of Canada. In keeping with its origins but definitely being forward-looking, Cascades is banking on its products that contain a high percentage of recycled fibers to distinguish itself from the competition, while remaining committed to the principles of sustainable development that is so dear to its corporate philosophy. Cascades also demonstrates that it understands that only innovation and the marketing of environmentally sound products will guarantee its future success. In 2003 and 2004, Cascades was named one of Canada's top 100 employers by Mediacorp Canada Inc. It was also awarded the same title in October 2008. The company is not related to American paper company Boise Cascade. 